Speed Bean. And yeah, I'm gonna kill. I'm gonna take you out. Oh, you're gonna shoot me in the face. One of the two is gonna happen. Very hard to time the uh, to time those if one of them's dead, because the timing completely changes. I like killing them with uh, badge powers because it's like, yeah, you know what? That cost me literally nothing. Didn't even cost me a turn. <laughs> it's amazing. And now I'll just get it back next turn anyway. So. Works out pretty damn well. So what's up here? A boomerang brother and 50 coins! 50 points! No hit, hell yeah. Okay, it's my day to play uh, Mario and Luigi Dream Team Bros again. Don't know why, but I feel like I've just suddenly got way better at this game. And that is amazing. So what is the point of here? Like, why? It's a it's a valid question, I think. What, why? Is it... <laughs> That's all for a one-up. This entire path is just for a one-up? And, okay, and a beam, and fifty, and fifty points. Oh, Mario's dead. Damn it! Notice a new hint appeared. Hit the hint box to check it. <laughs> Is that a you're doing so badly? Wait a minute, what's this? To defeat a peeler to lie, you need to use a taunt ball. Oh, you cannot. Wait, what, what are these? Be free. Bees that leave a bee host sometimes never return. Hitting the bee host at times like that will be consequence free. Defeat it while the bees are gone. Uh, you shouldn't stomp on the bees that go into the bee horse. You stomp them. Why is he giving me these hints now? <laughs> when a peeler battle R spouts two tongues of flame, watch its legs as it charges the attack. I never realised that you got that these hints are here. Does that change depending on whatever enemy you're fighting? I'm in like world 7 of the game and I've just found the tutorial mode. <laughs> That's almost as bad as connectables. <laughs> that is almost as bad as connectables, oh my god. It, 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 does this game actually have a tutorial mode? Like it's actually got hints? <laughs> I I had no idea. Also, that probably should have hit Mario, but it didn't, so I'm not going to complain. <laughs> Luigi stomping on fire. Oh my god, this game like, has hints. Okay, as soon as I get into another battle, I'm going to check those hints and see if they're, they actually correspond to whatever enemy I'm fighting at the time. Because if they do, and I've only just discovered them. I, I will I will just slap myself. <laughs> uh, so I guess that's all there is here in uh, in this particular la landscape of hell. Don't know what's with all the uh, the noms that are in the walls. They're just kind of chilling in the walls. They're not chilling in the walls anywhere else. They're just chilling in the walls here. And it's like, hi. And I'm like, hi. 
I'm like, hi. And I'm like, hi. And then I'm like, hi. Let's go get that attack piece. Oh my god. We're ready to go to the temple of the Pilo. Temple of our lord and masters, the Pilo. Our lords and masters. So let's get that, turn it, put it there, turn this as such, and then turn that one as such. Two of the... Uh, wait, did that count? No, that didn't count, okay. <laughs> I guess I didn't put it in right. Oh, damn it. I guess I didn't put it in right, I said. In. There. And to the end. So we're going to get the attack piece, and we're going to get the, uh, the, the ninth, the, no, the tenth attack piece for Summon on Woods, which is going to unlock a new attack, so let's try that. Let's have a look at it. What's it going to be? Jetboard Bash. Press and hold the B button to paddle. Press and hold the B button to paddle. As you draw near, press the A button. <laughs> is that a rocket-powered skateboard? I, I'm going to need a demo of this. I'm going to need a demo. So what, okay, we get the jet pad skateboard out, we press A, and then we hold down B, <laughs> and then at some point we press A. Okay, <laughs> let's practice. Alright, so, A, Luigi, get on the, get on the jet board. Hurrah! And then we hold down B, <laughs> and then at some point I need to go, BOOM! <laughs> Oh my god, that's amazing! <laughs> and I and I one shot it, so that means I must be able to get it every single time. And I, that totally was not a fluke in any way, and uh, it literally is just the easiest attack to ever use. <sighs> that must be what it means. There is no alternative. So, do I want to press this button or do I want to wait? Do I want to go across the bridge? Uh, button. What's this going to do? It gives us paths everywhere! Oh, I probably should have done that a while ago, then. <laughs> that would have saved a bit of time. But I didn't know it was here, so how could I, you know? Now that, now that we don't actually need to go everywhere. Okay, Luigi, Mario, 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 Luigi, 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 Mario, Luigi, Mario. <laughs> the end. The end! Okay. We got some fighting to do. B Lords. Oh wait, I said that I'd uh, I said that I'd look at the hints, didn't I? I said that I'd look at the hints. I'm gonna look at the hints and see if there's anything about the Boomerang Brothers. Okay, then what, as soon as he gets around to my turn. I'm going to look at the hints, and I'm going to be like, I'm going to probably kill myself. <laughs> well, Luigi's going to kill himself, or whatever. I'm probably going to kill myself as I realise that I could have actually known what I was doing. Oh, there is no hint section. Okay, thank you. I'm so glad. So it, just, it was just feeling, uh, it was just feeling sorry for me. Because I died a few times. Is that, was, that, was that a thing? No, I didn't even die a few times. It was feeling sorry for me because I would not hit it in a while. I have no idea. It was feeling stuff. It was feeling emotions it had never felt before. Okay, question. Can I use the taunt ball? Um, oh wow, you can actually use the taunt ball and just target one of the things in the bag. Okay, bandit. I kind of want that egg. Oh god. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know what I was supposed to do. I was supposed to, okay, I was supposed to hit the egg, but still. I didn't do it, and I've wasted the top ball, but whatever. <laughs> I don't care. 
I don't even care. And why would I? Why would I talk Commander Lacker to? Commander Lacker is my friend. He's been helping me. He's been helping me against the the evil, evil uh, Boomerang Bros. You know. Engage. Wow, that actually counts as jumping on his head as well. Awesome. Even though he's flying. I'll take it. Hey, I've got, I've got, I've got a top ball from that fight. <laughs> level 33. I'm still wondering what level we need to go to to get to rainbow rank. Maybe, maybe, maybe 34. Just, I thought it was 32 to be honest before, uh, before the last part. Uh, power, no. Defense, no. Speed, no. Stash, no. So we can get a 5 for BP or a 4 for health. I'm going to get a 4 for health. I'm going to get me a 4 for health. 204. That's quite a lot of health to be honest. Uh, that means that a, like, a, a normal 1-up mushroom is going to revive me until like 102. Which is probably the most health I'm ever going to be on. <laughs> I, never, I never make a point of fearing, feeling full health. As you guys should be well aware by now. Snareware! The heck is that? Increases defense while you're snared now. Uh, maybe it's like chance to snare an enemy when you... When you get hit by something. No special effects! Wow, that's nice. <laughs> but it does increase my power by... 30. Why is he increase my power by 30? Is that better than this? Screw it, I'm putting flame hammers on. I'm putting flame hammers DX on because I've got two of them now. And putting the snare wear on. That should that should uh, like increase my uh, jump my jump power as well. Which has been a problem because since I put took my uh, took my gear off. Oh here they all are. Here's all them beans. Since I took my gear off on Mario, I've been doing a lot less damage with my jumps. And it's been kind of noticeable. And it's been kind of poopy. <laughs> That's a technical term, poopy. Uh, I think I've probably got all the uh, beans. I've probably... I, I got the, the weird feeling that I've missed a bean or something, but... <sighs> get, get it? I would missed a bean? <laughs> I, don't, I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. So am I doing more damage with my jump now? It was like 30 before, now it's 35. That's a lot better. So I think that's pretty much it for uh, for this screen. I guess we'll just head towards the temple now. How many beans do we have? Because we've got quite a few since I said we were missing a bunch. Uh, 50 and 90, so there's four beans somewhere. Whether we've missed them, because, you know, they're not exactly the kind of thing that I would usually look out for. Or, maybe, or whether they're on the next screen. Yeah, this is the last screen, isn't it? And it does not look like they're here. So whatever, chances are we've missed them, I'll... I guess I'll do like a big search later, because... Because I do them, maybe, I've, maybe I did walk past them. If I did, then... I'm sorry for all the people that will have been screaming at the screen. <laughs> I apologise in advance. Behold, the Pilo Temple! It's not much of a temple, it doesn't even have a roof, jeez. Look in the centre! A huge power of Laura emanates from there. This temple will be our gate to the Z-Keeper. Okay. What is this thing? It stands in the way of where we must place the bed. Hmm. Yes, the bed must go there, but... Mario, can you help? Uh, sure, I guess I'll just hammer it into the ground. That's not going to do anything bad, right? No, no, nothing bad can possibly come of pressing a random button in a hidden secret temple. Okay, might have spoken too soon. Uh-oh. Pelodium. Pelodium. <laughs> what is that? A defense weapon created during the Pelo Kingdom era. It has likely protected this place since that time. Oh god, it's a giant super Lego bat. <laughs> Look serious! 
Mario, Luigi, be careful! I'm always careful, don't you be telling me what to do. Golden Beanie, let's leave him well alone. <laughs> I ain't touching him. No way. Now, Luigi! Luigi! What did I just say? You're a horrible person. 